some tweet that was getting popular on Twitter. It was like after this, somebody profiled Lena Dunham and was like, you know, they're like, at only 23, she sold girls and, you know, th- people were dragging it because now yeah. they recognize that who gives a shit about Lena Dunham. Mm-hmm. Right. But there was like some black dude that's like, I've brought in seven screenplays with, you know, blah, 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 <laughs> and, you know, story Bibles to every development meeting and told no. But yeah, sure. She gets it because she's a white woman or whatever and is blowing up. And then I click on the guy's name. And uh, <laughs> it's the guy that played Jar Jar Binks. <laughs> 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 no, yeah, no like, way. Like, who the fuck is this? That rock. No, you're not working because you played Jar Jar. Yeah, Binks. That <laughs> fucking rules. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh I have a God. master's degree in film. And That's awesome, dude. Jar Jar could get shit What's his name made? in real life? Dick, uh, Dick, Dick, Dick Stinks. He came up with that Jamaican alien character. Yeah, I forget. That is so fucking funny. I have to go back and take a look at Twitter. I mean, it's funny when people are like, because two things can be true. Lena Dime can be a dumb bitch whose parents are rich, and you can also be horrible at everything. You can also just be not good. Yeah. None of your screenplays can be good. I agree. Dumb rich assholes whose parents are like fucking New York elite or whatever shouldn't get shows. Mm -hmm. But that doesn't necessarily mean your screenplay is good as well. Yeah, I think she's had, like, representation since she was 12 or something. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Like, her her parents are, like, both whatever, you know. I don't understand why she, for some reason, gets people so mad. Yeah, everyone. The the hot hot girl on that show. There are so many infuriating people. Everyone. Everybody in show business. Half of them are. Yeah. There's half of, like... Actors are at people's kids, and now with fucking fucking, you know, now they got they can fucking look good. They can get fucking plastic surgery and look hot. Before, I bet you women didn't want to blow that pussy out, but now they can have kids. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Well, I think back in the day, like an Uma Thurman might not have had a kid. But now you're saying because she could get her pussy. <laughs> well, not her pussy, <laughs> but her, her body. Uh, yeah, you she know did. what I mean. They were probably under Wait, more pressure. She w- okay. I keep more check- pressure I keep to look check- better. I keep checking my phone and and uh, zoning out. Yeah, we're talking about. I like, don't know. Stops making some ridiculous. I'm not making. I'm women, making a good point. Women I don't know nowadays about that. will that seems have unfair and kind of out of character. <laughs> 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 about how women nowadays will have a kid because they can get their famous pu- women. Okay, they can get their pussies, not just their together. pussies, <laughs> but the rest of their bodies. Now a famous woman has a kid, and in like three months. Because she has a team of, like, fucking, you know, dermatologists, personal trainers, pussy tighteners, titty mm-hmm. plumpers. She's looking good immediately. I bet you, like, in the fucking 70s, if you had a kid while you were at the height of your stardom, they might not fuck. They, they would discriminate against you. I guess, yeah. Thank you. But Lena Dunham's, yeah, whatever. I mean, like, I just don't understand. So what I'm saying is now. Lena Dunham's whole body looks like the face of the bully. It's because she's fat, right? (laughs) That's why. It's like people are allowed to be mad at her because she's rich and annoying. Yeah. And she's ugly compared to to the hot ones. And ugly. Yeah, Yeah. really, really people, like, get that mad at her because she's ugly. Not, Not true. Maybe you, but no, I think you're projecting. I don't get mad at Lena Dunham. Like I don't. I've never well, seen girls. I mean, nobody gives a shit that she's fucking fat. It's like that's. I, I really don't. No, I'm not saying that. No, they on some care level, that they she's probably. Fat. I'm saying she's hot the people one people get that a pass in your brain easier she's than an ugly. The, one the type of pass that she gets is that she molested her sister, and nobody gives. A she yeah, put that, pebbles that in her sister's pussy. That became that became of. Not she put pebbles in her sister's pussy. She also was like masturbating in front of her sister when she was like 17. Mm-hmm. What? Is, yeah, that's also in the book. And they like fucking. What the fuck? How old it was, was in she? I mean, auto. Doesn't well. matter how old she was. But what the fuck? I'm just saying that people like <laughs> what? She, she was yeah. jacking off in front of her fucking sister. Yeah, and they're in bed together, and she's like masturbating next to her sister or whatever. She put that in the book, and it's like, I mean, honestly, if fucking Steven Crowder released an autobiography, right. it was like I would often play with my penis in front of my ten year old brother. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> Well, was it like a we're bunked up and there's nowhere to beat off type of thing? I don't care. Yeah. Listen, I mean, of course, I'm not saying. Yeah. But back in the day, guys would all jack off at sleepovers. Yeah, but you're the same. It's not like, no, yeah, yeah. It's it's like you know, all my friends would get together. And like, you know, I was a, a senior in high school. And most <laughs> right, of my, right, most my, of my friends, friends were in fifth ten. grade. <laughs> 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 and know, they were we, my blood relatives <laughs> also, by the way. We'd have sleepovers and yeah. I'd jack off. That's wild, dude. Mm-hmm. 
Um, no, no. My also point jacking is, off at a friend's sleepover. You'd be like, I'm jacking off. Don't look at me. Don't faggot. look at me, or you're gay. You're dude. gay if you look at me. <laughs> you're. <all> <laughs> <laughs> I'm jacking off to the memory of the thing on E-Bombs World we watched mm-hmm. three hours ago. I had a very traumatic experience at a sleepover where my friends were... Sucking your dick against your No, they were telling me that I couldn't c- bust because mm. I, uh, I, I was developing slower than them. Mm. And you looked at so your cock? my friend David made me go jack off in a bathroom. <laughs>